Hey everyone, Dr. Nussi here again with another video. And today I want to talk about the single reason, the number one reason, why someone would regain their weight after successful weight loss. That's coming up. My name is Dr. Matthew Nussi, and I'm here to tell you that weight loss does not need to be a chore. For over a decade, I've been helping my patients lose weight naturally so they can keep it off permanently. Now I want to bring that knowledge to you. If natural weight loss is something you might find valuable, please consider subscribing to this channel and then hit the bell notification icon so you're updated when I upload a new video. And now, on to the video. Okay, so let's dive right into it. I've done a video in the past where I gave a couple different, a few different reasons actually why people regain their weight. And I talked about things uh, like they didn't lose the right kind of weight from the beginning so they put the weight back on or um, they didn't have a maintenance plan already set in place before they started so they regained their weight. Um, and then I got a slew of uh, comments on other reasons why people uh, regain their weight. People in the comments uh, said things like they lost motivation or they had a significant life event happen which upset the apple cart and um, they couldn't stay on their diet. I'm here to now boil everything down to one singular reason. There really only is one reason why someone after going through the arduous task of reducing calories or counting calories or buying particular foods or whatever the diet is that they did, going through all that trouble, maybe all that expense as well, why then would they regain their weight and go back to that same position again? There's really only one reason. The reason is that it just becomes too much of a chore. It becomes another job. It becomes a hassle. I'm here to tell you that weight loss and weight maintenance has to be an enjoyable experience or at least a very tolerable experience. It has to be something that can be done that doesn't seem like a chore or else it is bound to fail. There's no way you can maintain something. We already have busy lives. We're already going to school and we have to take care of the kids and we're going to work and we have all these other responsibilities to, to do. We don't need another thing heaped on us um, that's just another task, another arduous task for us to take on. So weight maintenance especially. Weight loss can be difficult, it can be challenging, and that's okay. But weight maintenance must be tolerable, if not pleasurable and enjoyable. So there's got to be tools in place, not just that work, but that you will enjoy using. You've got to build some good habits. Um, you've got to figure out how to eat out at restaurants and for that not to sabotage uh, the weight loss that you uh, have achieved. We've got to build some, um, build into your lifestyle some recipes that you can cook and prepare and prepare in bulk so that you're um, that you've already got a menu set up for the next week and you've got to be comfortable with uh, prepping food and, and all these different things but there's got to be a maintenance plan in place that you learn from the beginning that you can stick with long term and that you know that you can stick with long term. Anybody can grind through a diet. Anybody can uh, lower their calories, do a fasting program, um, do uh, you know buy uh, prepackaged foods for a certain period of time. But long term, we need to have a maintenance plan that we can stick to. Do this exercise with me. Think about the last diet you did. Did you buy prepackaged foods? Did you take a, a prescription medication or did you take a hormone? If any of either of those three, any of those three apply, there's no way you can do that long term. You're already set up for a long term failure because you're not going to continue to buy prepackaged foods from a specific company forever. You're not going to continue, obviously, to take hormones forever to keep your weight off. You're not going to take a prescription drug forever to keep your weight off. You need to have a plan in place from the beginning so that there's a safety net so that you know you can maintain this long term. And if you go into it with the attitude of, well, we'll just get the weight off and we'll figure out the maintenance component once we get there, again, you're setting yourself up for failure. So I just wanted to kind of boil all of the reasons why people regain their weight after successful weight loss down to that one singularity and that really is the truth. The reason why people regain their weight is because weight loss and weight maintenance becomes too big of a chore 
to keep up with and they end up going back to the same habits that got them into the same situation they were previously. Okay, so I hope that helped clarify a little bit. Hope you like this style of video. If you do, please consider subscribing to my channel. You can do that by hitting this button right here. And then right over here, I've put another video that you can check out right now. Until next time, stay happy, stay healthy. I will catch everybody in the next video.